Here's our new view. You can see all the way to Punta Cancun. Here's turtle nests that are protected until the babies hatch. As you can see, our patio has been drastically reduced, but you know, that's okay. It's all set up and waiting for everybody. There's my Poppy Chulo. This is our old, see this corner right here? Our old room was the corner right there. That's why we had such a, a wide balcony. Where we started out. The square is much bigger because of the terrace and this is where we are now. Where are we going? To Isla Mujeres. Isla Mujeres. I'm sorry the camera keeps fogging up. We have about 10 minutes for the next one. We're gonna get in the queue. It was 600 pesos round trip for both of us. I will do the math and insert US dollars below. We're hoping to get a seat outside. Chewy doesn't do too well in inside on the seas. They used to be, remember, they used to be such little tiny boats. Uh -huh. Me puedo sentar enfrente. There's a revolving restaurant up there. Chewie and I ate one time. So there's different types of boats. This one has all seating across the top. Actually, ours might in the back, but this is a really big boat. Yeah. <laughs> they used to only be little ones. Now, to give you a point, all across here is the north part of the seven of the hotel zone, and I'll put a little arrow where the coral beach is where we got married. Adios Cancun. Hasta luego. It takes about 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. We're gonna crash into the dunk of my Okay, Poppy, what time it is? It, what time is it? It's five minutes till 10. So it, it took 25 minutes, 25 minutes yeah. with the docking. And they are every half hour? Every half hour, yes. The last boat from Isla 
to Cancun is at midnight. So here we are in the main drag. Most people who stay here for their entire vacation rent a golf cart for the week. I will put in now how long and how wide the island is. It's, it's not long at all. I want some, to buy some stuff. Right up here is a roundabout and it was filmed in Against All Odds. But if you know the area, he takes a boat to Tulum and all this stuff. And so part of it was filmed as if they were on Cozumel. I had to sit down and sit in the shade. The weather app says it's 90 degrees and it feels like 115. It is brutal out here, brutal. Within seconds, I just had sweat streaming down my face. So God bless my husband. He, um, the car, the, the golf cart rental is a block in. Um, and I, he said, no, I was like, I don't know if I can walk anymore because we've been walking for like five minutes. It's hot. But we're gonna take you all around the island. We're gonna see the Shell House, the Turtle Farm, down at Punta Sur, which is the southern point. They have a bunch of um, sculptures and stuff that they added down there. So we'll take you along. See you once we have the guard. My coach has arrived. Hey baby, I was like, oh, let me see how he's doing. Cause I thought it would actually take you a little longer. And then it showed you, cause I, you know, I stalk you on your phone. And I was like, oh, look, there he is. Gosh. Woo. It didn't take you as long as I thought. And again, I apologize for the wind. I forgot my muff. Here's the roundabout from Against All Odds. Yep. We're in Isla. Isla Mujeres. My favorite beach in the world is here. Playa Norte. There's the car ferry. It, it's very loud and it takes, like I think I said uh, yesterday, but if you didn't watch yesterday's, it takes an hour. Yeah. And then right. We're gonna go down the east side of the island and show you the shell house.
Chewy keeps calling these things lizards. I mean, he's from here. He should know better. That doesn't make you nervous? Why? Unter Sir. Pretty. This is all new. It used to just be you parked the golf cart and there was a pathway. There's the hotel zone off in the distance. I'll put a dot over the coral beach where we got married. But look at that water. This is this is what I dream of. Water this color. Wow. So as I mentioned earlier, this is all new, this structure. You know, I'm a little saddened by the by the Starbucks sign. <laughs> oh. I don't know. You, you know, want to take it? No. Why not? No. So, yeah. And the reason I'm sad about it is not because I have a thing about Starbucks. It's just Isla used to be this tiny, tiny little, you know, sleepy village. And there was a woman we were talking to from L.A. She said we used to go to Tulum all the time. And now it's just $20 drinks and boutique everything. And it's not like it used to be. No mas. Okay.